Hi everyone, I'm Tamanna and with the recent approach of Comet C2022, which will never be seen again by the way, we thought this would be the perfect time to explore Arabian astronomy and its heritage. I'm Hassan Ahmed Al Hariri, CEO of Dubai Astronomy Group and uh, we love astronomy. That's uh, <laughs> what I do actually. The ancient people, they looked at the stars and they made too much information out of the the sky uh, mapping and understanding the motion of the celestial objects. Arabs was also like any humankind on the earth or civilizations, they use this information and very well. In our local culture, it is embedded very well into that. Excitement here is palpable. We are out in the Al Qutra desert and we're waiting for this comet to appear. have a comet 2022 one which we are going to observe and uh, this comet at the beginning it was thought that it is coming after 50,000 years but the reality after NASA have done more calculations on its orbit they found that this is the first time it's coming up into the solar system and it will not ever come back to the solar system so it's a very rare occasion to see such a kind of uh, bright comet and people are really eagerly looking to look at it. This is something I believe it's in the DNA of the people where they are fascinated with the space and uh, everything above them. Along with the comet itself, we were able to catch a lucky glimpse of the International Space Station. It's so easy to understand why there are 800 people gathered here. Arabian astronomy is something you should definitely check out. With cameraman Neeraj, I'm the Manasajit.